An amendment introduced in the legislature would change the way our school system works here in the state. It does have many thinking about the effectiveness of the Nebraska State Board of Education. Channel 8's Mackenzie Johnson spoke with both sides of the amendment today. What do you have for us, Mackenzie? A proposed resolution would eliminate the state's Board of Education. Last year, a similar resolution was shut down before it reached debate, but it may be gaining more traction this time around. Allie French is with the Nebraskans Against Government Overreach. It's time for a change, and I think that it's very important that we allow Nebraskans to voice their opinion and take a vote on where they think that change needs to go directed. The amendment was introduced by Senator Joni Albright. If it's passed, it would eliminate the Nebraska State Board of Education. Instead, their job would be given to a commissioner of education who would be appointed by the governor. A similar proposal was brought up last year after the board received backlash for considering sex education standards. But Deborah Neary, a member of the board, says it doesn't seem like a solution. I, I'm not sure that I understand what they're trying to fix. We already rate one of, as one of the highest states in the country for educational achievement, even though we have the least amount of state funding going into our schools. French, who supports the amendment, says the Board of Education doesn't accomplish enough to make it worth the cost of funding it. But we aren't seeing the improvement in proficiency ratings in the districts across the state like we would expect to see from a state Board of Education that is doing a good job. French says getting rid of the board would hopefully give more power back to the schools to make the best decisions for their students. Opponents say the board is a necessary group for several reasons. We need to make sure that every single student is successful, and that means having some sort of, um, you know, standard across the entire state that is based in something academic and research and, and not just part of a local culture of thinking. And we are here to educate and to uh, stand for all kids in education, and um, that can't happen if we are not listening to everyone across the state and we don't have a voice. And we'll be keeping you updated on this resolution as it moves through the legislature on air and online on klcantv.com. All right, thank you, Mackenzie.